I muted myself, my bad. What's good guys, Young Tyler back with another Marvel Contest of Champions video. I know it's been a while, it's been like a week and a half, maybe even almost two weeks now. It's just, honestly, I felt like at the end of February there was, there wasn't much to do. I feel like last month was kind of stale when it comes to content and I don't know, I didn't have much to, to do, honestly. And on I was also very, very, very close to a six star and I didn't quite have enough. I was off by like the tiniest amount and I was trying everything I could to slowly get like more and more six star shards. I literally was only off by like 500 by the end of the event and I had like a week or so until this new event dropped. But I was just praying and waiting and waiting for some six star shards to come from this new event before this new event and it didn't happen. So now the new events here, I've already completed the um, the monthly event quest and I got some six star shards from the little side event quest that's going on, the Mole Man one. So we got ourselves a six star. We got our next six star, and I also have a thousand more shards. I don't know how that happened, but I do. Um, oh, it's from completing the event, probably. Um, anyway, so I also got two of the featured five star champions crystals. My hat look kind of whack right now. <laughs> Anyways, I got two of them because I, dude, I want Doom so bad. I want Doctor Doom. My shirt looking weird again. Remember that video way back when? When? Never mind. Yeah, I want Doctor Doom really, really bad. So. I need a really good Mystic Champion. I do. <sighs> so, maybe we can get him out of this. But for now, just for starters. Oh, another side note. Shout out to Hyperhex. He actually gave me this idea. He was like, oh, he did it. So I'm like, that's a kind of a good idea. And I asked him, do you think I should do it too? Because, you know, I've been debating it anyways. And now that you say it, I kind of want to do it. He uh, took his Four Star Neck Fury, maxed him out because of synergies with his Captain Marvel. Um, which is a great idea. But for me, I was like, man, I just, Four Stars are still kind of viable for me sometimes so you know I took up a my Nick Fury because I had one and I and I realized I don't know how I realized this but afterwards he's unawakened so I'm like I maxed out a Nick Fury that's not awakened that's a little crazy so I have to bring the Heimdall Angela sy synergy for him to even be like somewhat good of what he can be no he's good either way I take he's good either way but he's significantly better when he has his awakened ability like that's where you see huge damage come in that's where you get the unblockable um yeah all that stuff so we're gonna try to awaken him real quick um i bet money we're gonna awaken him right now on these three one of these three and we're gonna do this a little different than usual we're gonna spin these out because i actually want i actually want a specific thing so let's see if i can get a nick fury out of this first crystal today Namor, Corvus. I wish I didn't spend a uh, generic Awakening Gem now on Corvus. So, oh well. Because I had him forever and I used him for a long time, but I never could awaken him. So there's that. I can't be mad about it. More levels on Corvus. He gets his Glaive Charges back faster, I believe, now. With, with the Awaken ability. Higher Sig. So, you know, it's welcome. I use Corvus here and there still. Come on, Nick Fury. Not even close to a Nick Fury. The next one was Doom, though. Is that Premonition for my five stars? Hmm, who knows? Anyways, at the end of the day, these are more five star shards, so I'm not really mad about dupes at all. The only thing I don't want is a brand new champion. Let's see here. Let's see here. Nick Fury. Ah, oh, you see that troll over right there from Doom? <laughs> and I got a new champion. <laughs> Anyways. Um... Alright, I like the Corvus dupe, and I like the shards, and I got the ISO. I need the ISO, because I just had some expire. I was so upset. I was like, if only I got the 6-star... Never mind. It's a tangent. So, I mean, we saw Doctor Doom twice in the rear. He was right next to us twice. And that's a premonition that one of these is a Doctor Doom crystal. If this is Doom, I will literally cry. On camera. Don't hold me to that. Just so that we can draw this out a little longer because I'm nervous and I don't want to do it, but I've been waiting to do it for a while. We're going to open up some premium premium hero crystals. Oh, I'm so nervous because it's, you know, the featured, you know how it is. I could literally get two. What's the worst champion in here right now? I could literally get like two Iron Mans or two. I don't want to say that. I'm not putting that out there. I'm not putting it out there. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Just real quick, pop these real fast, see if we get a 4-star out of it. 4-star Nick Fury, though. 4-star Nick Fury, though. Got some connection issues, as usual. Kabam. Thanks for that. I hope it's Kabam and not me. 
some more connection issues. There we go. We got a three star champion out of it. I don't know. All right. All right. Here we go. Two featured five stars. This is the most I've ever done on the channel. Two featured five stars. <laughs> But yeah, I have to, this, I've never done two featured five stars before in a row, so this is kind of cool. I'm only doing this because I have the sigil. I got the sigil and I'm Cavalier now, so it's only 11,000 shards. I'm like, that's not even that bad, really, from 10,000 to 11 for 1,000 extra for maybe a Doctor Doom featured champion. So I think it's a pretty good deal. Let's stop it right here. All right, let's see what I get. Oh, there's Doom. Come on, come on. We awakened our five star Venom the deck. I'm not mad. I'm not super mad about that. I'm not super mad about that. That's pretty good. I will take that. I was thinking about taking him up anyways. Okay, well, that's not Doom, though. We want Doom. That's why we got these crystals in the first place. It's for Dr. Doom. So please, please give me a five-star Dr. Doom. Please. I got a new champion. You see that? Ooh, Vision Arcus, another cosmic champion. Dang, that's pretty sick. That is pretty sick. He's a pain. I almost said something bad on camera. He's a pain in the butt to fight. I hate fighting him. Absolutely hate fighting him. That is sick. I might have to take a look into ranking him up a little bit, honestly. That's a sick pull. I'm down for that. I knew we got a... I can't be doing that to myself. I hate that that's a thing. I saw up here in this on this little player profile that I got a new champion. I was like, ah, that's not Doom because I have a Doom. But who is it? That's pretty cool. Honestly, Clairvoyant would have... Oh, she's not even in there anymore. There is a Clairvoyant, I think, in the six-star hero pool now. Also, Bloodstone, Clairvoyant. Black Widow, Clairvoyant would be so sick. Six-star Warlock? I get two Warlocks? Mmm, that might be kind of cool, too. Alright, I can't get ahead of myself, because I could very much still get Rocket Raccoon and Iron Man and all of them. I don't want to say that. I don't want to say that. Alright, guys, here we go. <sighs> Let's pet method this six-star. That's the problem. We didn't pet method. I can't be mad. Two featured crystals. We got a Venom the Duck, Awaken. That's nice. And we got a Vision Arcus. I've been saying I want a really good Cosmic Champion for a while. I know he's not the best Vision Arcus, but he... Uh, I'd have to do some more looking around on, on you know other content creators and see what kind of videos they have out with him. But he might be a potential rank up. Because this game isn't always all about everyone has the same roster, everyone is doing the same big champions because it's like the best. The only one I could think of like that might be like if you get a Doom... Or if you get an Aegon, it's like you kind of need Aegon for some for some things, um, like Labyrinth of Legends and Abyss. So it's like eh, he's one of those champions that if you get him, you rank him up. But you know the uniqueness of this game is there's so many champions and so many uh, yeah champions for you to choose from and to create your own team that's unique to you. And I think that's amazing. So maybe I will take Vision Arcus up and use him because I was using Torch for a while back when. Certain big content creators are saying he wasn't very good. Not Legacy. Legacy's been on him forever, and I'm, I'm, I appreciate that big time. Stealth Spidey, same thing. Those two are champions that I think have gotten a lot of attention recently. That I was low-key like, yeah, I knew it. I knew you guys would see their, their potential. So maybe Vision Arcus can be the same way. So far, I have a trend like that. Anyways, we'll see. We'll see. Let's open the six-star hero crystal. So pet method, we went in, we went out. Now we just went back in for the second time. Going out, going back in again, because I don't remember. Um, we're going to go four corners up in this B. I mean in this thing. Hit the center and drop it. Oh, man, okay. Who do we want? I would love a ghost. Ghost would be so sick. I can't even say that. Corvus would be so sick. I'll take a Sentinel. Um, Havoc, I guess. Gladiator Hulk would be sick. I don't want to void Loki. I think I'm just going to let this spin out. Oh, man. Who do I want? You already know who I want. You guys know who I want. I'd love a Black Widow Clairvoyant. Black Widow, Black Widow Clairvoyant. I can't speak right now. Oh, man. I don't know. Domino would be absolutely insane. I don't want a dupe, and I don't want a bad champion. I just don't want a bad champion. I feel like it would be so sad if we got something bad. Um, it's almost... Almost, it's not a dupe. Let's see what we get here. Come on, come on. Give me something good. No, not X. No. <laughs> right next to Havoc, too. One more rollover. We would have got the six-star Havoc. Dang, Superior Iron Man. That's one of the worst pulls you can get. That's awful. He's not even getting ranked up, I'm going to be honest. I mean, leveled up. He's staying down low. Man, that's tough. 
That's really tough. Well, today's opening was definitely very hot and cold. I had very mixed feelings about it. We didn't get our Nick Fury Awaken, but we got some dupe levels on Corvus, which I'm happy about for a four star because I still use him. Um, got Vision Arcus. We awakened our Venom the Duck. And we got a. What's up with all the Cosmic Champions today? And we got a six star Iron. I literally got all Cosmic pulls. Okay. Well, maybe that's good because maybe that means that there's a ton of ISO. Maybe that's the Kabam Lords telling me Kabam, Mike, and all of them. I don't know the other ones. I'm, I'm on the forums a lot, but I don't look at the names. It's kind of weird. Um, oh, look at him. He looks so trash. I don't like it. I don't like seeing that character in my roster. Anyways, um, so let me let me filter this real quick. By Cosmic. Five stars. So we have Vision Arcus now. We have our Venom the Duck Awakened. Um, Loki, if I had awakened Medusa, I'd probably end up taking her up. But since she's not awakened, I don't really want to take her up yet. I'd probably wait on that one. Um, Vision Arcus, I don't know if he needs his awakened ability. I actually do not know that. Um, if he does, then I might not wake him up, rank him up, and I might just rank up Venom the Duck. But if he doesn't, Vision uses his connection to the smoke world to shrug off non-damaging debuffs. I mean, that's more of a defense thing, I feel like. I mean, not really, not really. God, I can't speak. I think it is still kind of a defense thing, because non-damaging debuffs, so things like Exhaustion and Innervate and stuff like that, I mean, I guess it could have its uses. I see that. But I don't think it's going to be, like, a game-changing thing for him, like, gameplay-wise. So, you know, maybe he will get, a, he will get ranked up a little bit. Um, maybe you'll see some gameplay from me. I don't know. But anyways, that's the video for the Crystal opening today. That's the end of it. Um... Also, side note, if you're still here, the homies, um, I might have an update video for the channel coming, maybe even today, like right now, but yeah, nothing crazy, just there's going to be some changes to the way the channel's going, and the direction of the channel, the future of it, I'm not going to get into it too much now, I'll probably do it in this next video, but um, yeah, I'm pretty excited, I'm honestly really excited for what me and Ethan have planned for the future, so thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching me get pretty good. Pretty good luck on the featured five stars. I'm not mad about them. But but watching me get wrecked by that six star. My third six star and I got destroyed. I was doing everything I could to get six star shards. And I was just pleading to get some more shards so I can get my third six star champion. And that's what it is. But I can't be mad because my first one was the champion. Who's not a bad champion at all. And I've come to like him a lot after playing with him as a six star. Um... And I got Emma Frost for my second one, so I can't really be mad about a superior Iron Man pull. <laughs> it's low-key well-deserved. But that's what I have. Whoa, you see that? Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'm dragging this on again. I always do that. But I'll catch you in the next video. I don't know what that is, but peace out. <laughs>